ChatGPT, show me pasta. Pasta. How am I supposed to eat that? Cook it. Cooked and take away the green stuff. Without green. Not enough Parmesan. Generously coated. Some of that pasta did not touch the sauce. Thoroughly coated. Everything in cheese. Drenched. More tomato sauce. Swimming in. Melt the cheese more. Cheese bubbling. What is that landmass in the middle? Is there a burger under that? Beef strips. Succulent beef. I didn't want a burger. Give me my melted Parmesan on the pasta. A lot of tomato sauce. Don't make the middle too heavy. The right balance. Add a steak. Cut it into strips. Mozzarella stick. A steak. Not a stick. And cut the steak into strips. A stick. No sticks. Dump a crazy amount of cheese. Some pepperoncino. Celebration of. Yes. Tomato basil soup with a side of garlic bread. Lavish dining. What happened to all that cheese? How did the steak glue back together? No magically. A whole clove of garlic? Where's the tomato sauce? Generously. Whose hands are those? Did you break the fork on the steak? Quit messing around. No. ChatGPT, show me a grilled cheese sandwich. Grilled cheese. Why is there cheese on my crust? Just as you. You shrink it bigger. Cut it open. Let me see what it looks like. Gooey. Cheddar and pepper jack. I want you to almost burn it. Melted. Just give me one grilled cheese. Just shy of burnt. You didn't melt the cheese enough. Classic grilled. I take a big bite out of it. Toasted nearly to the. Put a glass of orange juice next to my grilled cheese. Satisfying bite. Get rid of the orange. I just want the juice. Refreshing glass of. What happened to my grilled cheese? With the glass of. Of. What's in that bowl? There isn't a bowl. Oh, yeah, it's like a bowl of mangoes. Grilled cheese sandwich and glass of. Where did the mango come from? No mangoes. Just add some bacon bits in my grilled cheese sandwich. I want a nice crunch. Has crispy bacon bits. Bacon bits? Don't put the whole pig in there. Finely chopped bacon. What is. Revamped. Take a big bite. A real bite. A bite, not a cut. <laughs> ChatGPT, show me a brownie. Freshly baked. Add some walnuts. Walnuts. Vanilla ice cream next to it. Next to the chocolate syrup on that vanilla. Poured over. I said next to my brownie. Let me know if this. Take everything off. Brownie. Vanilla ice cream to the left of the brownie. To the left. Walnuts on my sprinkled chocolate syrup on my vanilla. Drizzled. Cut my dessert. Both the brownie and the vanilla on my fork. Bite size. A bigger piece with some vanilla ice cream on. Holding a. Is that a fork? A whole brownie and vanilla on the fork? How big do you think my mouth is? Right size. It's floating. On the fork. Cut into my dessert. Brownie and vanilla. Sit on the fork. One bite. Not the whole thing. Single bite. That's not my hand. Why is the brownie the size of my finger? Without hands. You shrink my brownie even more. It's so small. Is this a brownie for ants? Realistic portion. Fork next to the plate. Chocolate syrup drizzled on my vanilla ice cream. Walnuts on top of my brownie. Please. Satisfying. Cut out a piece. A piece of brownie and piece of vanilla ice cream on the fork in my mouth at the same time. Wow! ChatGPT, show me milk and cookies. Milk and cookies. Extra thick and gooey. Too big! What is that, a chocolate chip pancake cake? Just as you. Add some cinnamon in my milk. The sprinkle of. What am I gonna do with cinnamon sticks? Chew them, heat up my milk. Now warm. Get rid of the cinnamon sticks. No cinnamon sticks. Brown sticks out of the picture. Without any. Fine. Open up the chocolate chip cookies. I wanna see how thick and creamy. Interior. Too thick! That's a cake! Put it next to my milk. Also, put a fork. Perfect balance. You burnt my cookies! It's crusty on the edges and it looks Dry. Blech. The milk. There's no cinnamon. It's not even hot. No burnt or dry. Cinnamon back in my aromatic flavor. You drop some chocolate chip. No chocolate chips fallen. Open up one of the cookies. I want to see what it looks like inside. Creamy interior. How did it get so big? Make it a little smaller. Looks like a hamburger patty. I've adjusted the still thick like a muffin. Just show me what my plate looks like after I've eaten all my thoroughly savored. Like all of it. Clean. One left. No items. Chips. Fine. Let's take a closer look at those chips. Nah! ChatGPT, are you familiar with your mama jokes? A playful insult that targets someone's mother. Remember these jokes can hurt people's feelings. Your mama's so fat that when she sat on a quarter, she squeezed a booger out of George Washington's nose. You get it? Yes, I get it. Say one back to me, a funny one. All right, here's one for you. Your mama's so fat, when she steps on a scale, it says to be continued. No! ChatGPT, show me instant ramen. Instant ramen. That's not instant ramen. I mean a cup ramen. You know, you pour water in there and then it just cooks for you. Adding hot water. You put a plastic spoon in there, it's gonna melt. But it drink plastic. Without utensils. The noodles in the foam? What's instant ramen? Drop an egg in there. Egg cooked halfway. Why is the foam melting? I can't drink that. Cup intact. Add kimchi and pork. Kimchi and pork. Take away the onion. Removed green onion. Still there on the left. Another attempt. Take all the green stuff out of the... Removed Green. All the vegetables out. Without vegetables. What's that green stuff poking out? 
Just noodles and broth. Show me the color green! Green. Take this color out of my- Without green. No! Just give me an empty cup. Empty cup. Add a pack of dry ramen noodles. Ready for a satisfying- Put the block of ramen noodles in the cup. We're gonna cook the bag too? No bag. Add hot water. Ready to eat. Add an egg. Egg added. Add some kimchi. Kimchi. What's that green stuff? No green. I still see green. You took my egg away. No! ChatGPT, what does this say? An image from the game show Wheel of Fortune showing a puzzle board with no letters revealed. Take a wild guess. Sweet dreams are made of this. No! Let me give you a hint. Na 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 Ah, uh, sweet dreams are made of this. No! Here's another hint. Never gonna, never gonna. Got it. Never gonna give you up by Rick Astley. Yes! ChatGPT, show me Chinese New Year. A vibrant and more Asians fighting over the bill. Who gets to pay? Unlimited relatives. Mountains of red envelopes. Fortune cookies everywhere. Unlimited relatives. Screaming Asian kids holding bags of red envelopes. With bags of unlimited traffic. Uber Eats flying up and down the street. Fireworks and dragon dances. Chung, 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 chung. Uber eats with wings. Eating so much Chinese food they gave birth to food babies. Indulging in combine all the joyful chaos. Thousand times more Chinese New Year. Thousand times over. Unlimited ancestors in their mansions beyond the grave. Amidst grand mansions. Combine the last two ultimate earthly celebrations. Make it a trillion times more Chinese New Year's. Eternal bond across the turn this into a giant Chinese grandpa. Unlimited wads of Chinese kids eat the cash and become Chinese dragon. <laughs> Majestic. The dragons merge and fly. Embodying the spirit of. Turn this into a movie poster. Happy Year in the. Sora, show me a Bollywood movie. A valiant and muscular police officer standing firmly in the middle of the road. His expression resolute. He's dressed in a crisp khaki uniform that symbolizes authority and justice. The sun glints off his aviator sunglasses as he pulls out his service revolver with a steady hand. As the car barrels towards him, he takes aim and fires a single well-placed shot at the front tire. The bullet hits its mark, and the car immediately loses control. It skids on the asphalt, then flips dramatically, rolling multiple times in a stunning display of physics and cinematography. Debris flies, and the sound of crushing metal fills the air. The scene slows as the car comes to a crashing halt, upside down, its wheels spinning uselessly. The officer walks towards the wreckage with determined strides, his face a mask of righteous fury. He reaches the car, bends down, and forcefully drags the dazed criminal out of the shattered window. With a display of raw strength, he lifts the criminal off the ground, holding him by the collar of his shirt, and throws him onto the road. The officer stands tall, a silhouette against the sun, as the criminal lies on the ground, defeated and apprehensive. The camera zooms in on the officer's face, capturing the unwavering resolve in his eyes. <laughs> That's a scene from Sing Him! It's actually a Bollywood movie! Oh my god! Chat GPT, show me pho! Pho. Take a the peppers without peppers take away all the green green removed show me what green looks like green that's great take this out of my green out Why is it all right make it bigger i am really hungry faux brimming too much how many days do you expect me to eat this sprinkle some cilantro wine fried spring rolls satisfying meal double that spring rolls in the soup doubled faux fit for a king pull some up with the chopsticks fit for a king bigger ball majestic faux i finish half half finished you didn't even Touch it! More MSG! Extra MSG. Why is the MSG floating? Squeeze the lime! Flavorful and... What is MSG? Full spoon as MSG! Pho with all the soup drank already. All the soup has been... No soup! Broth consumed. Drink all the soup! What the hey -yay? Just noodles and remaining... Uh, only the noodles, meat, and toppings. Please! No! Just show me the bill. Yes! Chat GPT, make this sound more polite. The hell? Why are you putting A minus home on test? You're not my son. When I was your age, I was older than you. Every day I drive you to school. When I was a kid, I walk eight hours to school and walk eight hours back after nine hours of school. Today, I change your legal name to Irish because you bring shame to the family. I'm surprised to see an A- minus on your test. Are you struggling with anything? When I was your age, I had to work very hard under different circumstances, like walking long hours to school. I make an effort every day to drive you to school, so I hope you can appreciate that. Please understand that we value education in this family, and I would like you to uphold that. Can we discuss how you can improve? Send up! ChatGPT, return random words to me without punctuation. Only give me words separated by a space. Don't give me any commentary. Provide as many words as you can. Don't repeat the same word twice. Nice. Whisper Galaxy Ocean Melody Breeze Twilight Serenade Echo Lullaby Moonlight Cascade Velvet Starlight Symphony Azure Tranquility Silhouette Sonata Dawn Sapphire Emerald Quartz Harmony Rhythm Waterfall Nebula Orchid Diamond Azure Melody 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 R
GPT, make this sound more mean, intimidating, and aggressive. Look, man, you talk about my girlfriend like that one more time, and I'll show you. Listen up and listen good, you pathetic excuse for a human being. I've been patient, I've been forgiving, but every ounce of that goodwill has been exhausted. Continue to spew such vile filth about my girlfriend and I promise you'll regret it. Remember this, you pitiful worm. You are nowhere near my league and you certainly don't deserve the privilege of even speaking her name. I've got a breaking point and you're teetering dangerously close to it. One more slanderous word about her and you'll ignite a fury in me that even hell itself would shudder to withstand. So go ahead. Make your choice. Stay in your lane and keep your petty, pathetic comments to yourself, or cross that line and face the whirlwind of consequences that I assure you, you are not prepared for. Let me make this crystal clear. You won't just be dealing with a mere argument. You'll be inviting a world of hurt and chaos into your pitiful existence. Consider yourself warned. Step out of line again and you'll awaken a beast that will make your worst nightmares look like child's play. Send.